Hello guys, welcome to my channel. In this video, we will troubleshoot the issue. Your computer is not discoverable in your network or if you are getting any kind of error that your network is turned off or you are not able to access the PC or the other thing like printer and the file and folders. Okay, so first you need to make sure that the folder you want to share is shared. Okay, so how to share your folder first? Let's say let me make a new folder. Okay, this is the share folder I name. Okay, so once you made it, you need to right click on that, go to its properties. Okay, and then go to sharing tab and then go to advanced sharing then click on share this folder okay and click on add permissions and you make sure everyone is selected by default it is selected here so give all the permissions here allow it click on apply click on ok apply then click on ok okay and then click on share option here and add it to everyone everyone add it and give all the permission read and write as well so that he or she can modif modify it click on share now it's taking time so it is shared now you can see the done after that close it okay once you close it go to this pc file explorer and click on network and click on your folder and make sure the share folder I have just created it it's shareable okay if I make a content inside this so I can easily view from here so this is the first step to make sure that the file and folder is shared if you have confirmed that the file and folder is shared then we can enable the discovery okay so network discovery is important in order to access the share file and folders so we have to make sure that it is enabled so go to here the connected network then click on network setting after that scroll it down and look for network and sharing center once you click on that click on change advanced sharing settings okay and first click on here private and make sure you turn on this network discovery if it is off like this you need to turn it on okay this should be checked turn on file and printing share click on save changes okay once you save changes close this and then move to the guest or public and I have turned it off so if you are running cafe and public network so you can turn it on also this option turn on network and discovery so turn it on also and click on save changes and after that all network expand this option also and turn on sharing and turn on sharing so everyone with the network can access read in that files and public folders so click on turn on and this should be turned on and this you can turn off the password protected okay so need, no need to enter the password once you select this option click on save changes okay after that we have successfully enabled our network discovery if your issue is fixed then well and good if not move to the third method in the third method we will enable the smb 1.0 protocol which is responsible sharing file and folders and the printer as well so go to control panel open control panel click on view by and select the large icons here i have already selected click on programs and features after that click on this option turn windows feature on or off click on that and you need to scroll it down and look for SMB where it is this option 
SMB 1.0 sharing support. Tick this option, expand this, okay, and make sure you select all the items here automatic removal, client, CFS service, and click on OK. Once you click on OK, searching for required files, it will install. Let's wait. Okay, you will see the message windows completed or requested changes. You need to restart your system. Okay, restart your system and try after. If still not fixed, we can go to the CMD. Okay, run it as an administrator. Yes button when the prompt opens and type for flush. I pick config flush DNS. IP config space slash flush DNS like this hit OK. Now you will see successfully flush the DNS resolver cache exit and see if your issue is fixed or not. So hope these four steps one of them is working for you. If yes then hit like subscribe and share. Thank you. Thanks for watching and I will see you in a next video. Thank you.